All right, gang, I got a question. I got me a new gas cap. And this one is off of a 71. I don't know if it's just a 71 Mustang or if it's a 71 Mach 1 or what, but on a 71, this bar, this impression on it, it goes up and down. And I know it's kind of crooked right now, but I'm going to make it go side to side to match the taillights. And it is a pop open cap. So, I know uh, the holes in it that these holes right here don't match what's in the tail panel already, so I'll just drill some new holes to get it straightened. My question is where this thing mounts, should I recess it in to lose that gap? Or should I just leave it alone? So it would require me to cut a hole just a little bit bigger than this ring right here on it on the back side. Weld in how much of this is. Weld in a piece backspace it that much in there and weld it to the inside of the ring that I just cut to where all the bolts would mount inwards to recess it in so that this will come down and be flush pretty nice gas cap It'd be better once it's straight but I just put it on there to see how much gap there was it's got your fuel filler neck, a gasket, and then the taillight panel has a little bump out in it, just a little bit to begin with. So, let me know. Thanks. Alright, back, back to this gas cap. I can take the fuel filler neck, wherever I sat it, there it is. I can slide, slide this on the inside, put the gasket on this side, on this edge instead of, instead of on the back side, and mount the cap directly right there. But in order to do that, you can see the bumped up edge here. I have to hammer and dolly that down. So, I mean, either way it work. One's probably easier than the other, but uh, somehow I have to get this edge flush so that the cap can mount flush to the outside of the body. So, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts.